Four days ago, a plane landed bearing a man who claims to be 2,000 years old. Sir, when were you born? Close to 2016 to this October the 16th, I'll be 2,000 yeah. years young. How we say young, you yeah. know? Yes. Not to curse ourselves, <laughs> you know? Could you give us the secret of your longevity? Well, the major thing is that I never, ever touch fried food. <laughs> I, I don't eat it, I wouldn't look at it, and I don't touch it. Yes, but I think most people are interested in living a long and fruitful life yes. as you have. You mentioned... Fruit is good, too. You mentioned fruit. <laughs> yeah. Fruit it? kept me going for 140 years once when I was... I was on a very strict diet, <laughs> mainly nectarines. I love that fruit. It's a half a peach, half a plum, Sir. such a hell of a fruit. I Sir. love it. <laughs> not too cold, not too hot, you know, Sir. just nice. What has been Even your... a rotten one is good. I love them so much. <laughs> That's how much I love them. I'd rather eat a rotten nectarine than a fine plum. What do you think of that? <laughs> I can understand that. Yes, that's how much I love them. Yes, I can understand that. Yes, yes. Sir? Some good things. Sir, what sir. did you do for a living? Well, many years ago, thousands of years ago, we would make, uh, take a piece of wood, see, and rub it, and, and rub it, and clean it, and look at it, and hit a tree with it. For what purpose? Just to keep busy. There was nothing to do. <laughs> there was absolutely nothing to do. That we had no jobs, don't you What see? other jobs were there? <laughs> There must have been something else besides hitting a tree with a no, piece of that, stick. No, that, well, hitting a tree with a piece of stick was already a good job. I mean, yeah, right. you couldn't get that job, you know? What job? Mainly was sitting and looking in the sky was a big job. And another job was watching each other was one thing. <laughs> that was light work, looking at each other. By the way, sir, uh, are you married? I have been married several hundred times. <laughs> several hundred yes. times? Yes, I... What? I'm afraid to ask the next question. You had many hundreds of wives. Hundreds and hundreds of wives. How many children Two. do you have? I have over 42,000 children. <laughs> and not one comes to visit me. <laughs> in an afternoon. Oh, that's yes. terrible. You bet. How they forget a father. Sure. That's how they... That's end. awful, sir. It's really... They could send a note and write, how you pop, how you doing pop, you know, they something. No, no they don't. Sir, um, you must have known some great men in your time. You did travel throughout I the world. I knew the great and the near great. Sir, how about some of the legendary characters who supposedly might have existed? For instance, Robin Hood. Did he exist? Oh, yeah. Lovely man. Did Ran around in the forest. Did he really steal from the rich and give to the poor? No, he didn't. He didn't? He stole from everybody and kept everything. <laughs> Well, well, how did legend... How did legend? How did legend spring up that he was... He had a fellow, Marty. Marty, the press agent, ran in all the papers and wrote in scrolls. He took from the rich, he gave to the poor. Who knew? Who knew? He'd give you such a knock in the head when he robbed you, you wouldn't remember anything anyway. So in other words, uh, we... He was a tough guy. I hate to have our, our legendary figures smashed like Well, this. I hate to smash him for you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, sir, uh, we space. don't have too much more time, but we all here would like to know your code. Well, all right. Is this it? Your right. Right. Farewell. Okay. Farewell address. Keep your smile on your face and eat a nectarine. It's the best fruit ever made. <laughs> that has done.